poem started out as a poem. Um, it started out as a poem with the same premise. And I remember speaking to Brandon, my partner, um, and he was like, you know, this could be a film. This could definitely be a film. Like, this sounds like a film. This feels like a film. And so we, we started talking about it and then went in and I started writing. And he was such a, a paramount person to be in the film, not even just for him because he's a wonderful actor, and, but because he's also a storyteller. So running off things with him and, and finding inspiration with things that he had to say and also keeping true to the text um, really is how it came to be. As a, as a queer person and as a Black person, we know that these stories exist, right? We, we all know the uncle who had a lover their whole life that we didn't know anything about in the family, but he was always around. They, I mean, they, and they were, without us knowing who they were because the family didn't speak about this couple, they were the best couple that we saw. They were the most healthy relationship. They were together for 50 years. They, you know what I mean? Like, they took care of each other when they got old. Brandon is not only my business partner, but he's a, a, a friend of like a friend who I love. Uh, he's a queer gay man. We love each other deeply, you know? So it's like, and I, I mean, I know so many other friends, black gay men who love me and like would, would go through anything for me and with me, you know? And so let alone loving each other. And so I just wanted to show that. It's something that I see all the time and it's just something we don't see in media. I think. People have a particular way that they want to look at gay men in particular, and specifically black gay men. Mm -hmm. We have our own things with that in the black community, as you know. Um, and one of them is that stereotype that, that gay men cannot love each other or are incapable of love. And everything that I've seen in my life shows the opposite. Um, and it's the lack of representation. You know, I think this film was really about representing something positive. Queer relationships are never seen, or not often seen in positive forms. Like, I had this epiphany walking down the street in Brooklyn being like, wow, like, the, the distress is that we don't see any positive relationships on screens. And people that growing up, they need to see this. You need to see, I needed to see functionally, functional relationships that doesn't have any violence. There's just nothing, it's just simplicity. These people are showing up for each other. and. When you don't see that, you, you know, there's always uh, this misconception that we're always dysfunctional mm -hmm. when, yeah. we're, when we're functional. 